Do you razor the glue off a back window? No, do not take a razor blade to a back window. So on a back window, you're gonna wanna use something like this. Um, so there's a few things that we can use while that thing's baking, and there's things that we can talk about. So there are three uh, main types of adhesive removers, and there's also a um, few different types of scrub pads that people use. So we actually have a whole bunch of stuff that we can kind of talk about for removals. So when you're trying to remove glue off of back windows, uh, the Tri-Edge Scrub It, uh, that's what this paddle thing is here. It comes in a green and a blue. Um, the green Scrub It was designed for everyday glass cleaning and light duty scratch resistant pan cap. Pan pad in tan. So that's what these are right here. These are the replacement pads that they sell. Um, so these ones are lighter, which is good that it tells me here because I honestly, it doesn't mark it on the packaging. Um, so I didn't remember which one was lighter or which one was more aggressive. The tan ones are, are lighter. I like the look of the green better though, but we have the blue one out right now. And the blue ones are more aggressive, um, but they're both glass safe. So these are really good. Um, also, these are the 3M white scrub pads that have been very popular for a long time, too. So if you like these, you can get them. And if you like the scrub it, you can actually just put one on here, cut it out, and then if these pads just Velcro onto the scrub it. So these are replaceable. Now, that's scrubbing pads. Now, what you're going to want to do for a removal is obviously steam the film off, get all the, get all the plastic off. Uh, as best you can um, because if you leave like a, a thin layer or little pieces and stuff the the adhesive removers are not going to get in there so if you have glue that's left behind which is usually more often than not you're going to be using any one of these three things right here so we have ATR uh, we have epic orange which is fusions uh, adhesive remover and then we also have Awesome, uh, LA's Totally Awesome, which you can buy at the dollar store, actually. Um, this is actually also at Home Depot, I think. Um, but this stuff works really, really well for adhesive remover. And my second favorite is honestly the ATR. Um, I've been using ATR for years. Um, a close third is, is the Epic Orange. Um, it does work, um, but more often than not, uh, it's got like a different smell to it, but more often than not, uh, ATR seemed to tackle more situations than that. Um, it, that was just my, for like automotive glass. Architectural is gonna be different. So those are the main three that you're gonna wanna use. I'll have links in the description too, um, coming up after the live stream and stuff on where you can get that type of stuff. But any one of those uh, should do the job for you. So we're gonna be removing all this film and then afterwards we're gonna spray it and then we're going to uh, scrub it down with one of those paddle scrubbers and then squeezy it off and then after you do that hopefully uh, you have a nice clean back window. Uh, how much do you charge to carry out a job of this type? Uh, a lot of questions on the on the expense. So uh, the removal charge is kind of separate um, and some people charge by the hour and whatnot uh, this one's going to be uh, six for the whole, like a little over six for the full job. We're doing carbon and a windshield strip and a full removal. So just kind of spray everything down. Take a deep breath outside the car. <laughs> oh my God. Or wear a respirator. Because sometimes this is, on hot glass, this is going to be evaporating. I haven't used this stuff in a minute. ATR was one of the lesser ones though. It wasn't really like, it doesn't have an offensive smell to it. it just kind of smells like a, some type of a cleaner thingy. That's why I mentioned uh, Epic Orange. Um, it, it doesn't have a bad smell, it's just very unique. I don't even know how to describe it. But it smells like it kind of hang around a little bit. I don't know. There were um, some of the orange chemicals, um, like citrus-based chemicals, 
<laughs> I used concentrated degrees, sir. And boy, let me tell you, the air was spicy in there. <laughs> oh, I can imagine. Purple Super Clean's got to be scarring my lungs. Oh, you guys. Oh, that's hilarious. You guys know exactly what I'm going through right now, then. So this stuff isn't that offensive, really. But it's not... Like, we just used uh, a steamer, so the glass is warm. But it's not, like, baking. So it's not like I just brought it in here, left it outside in the sun, peeled it, and sprayed it, and evaporated or in a hot garage, so... I think that's pretty much it. I think we just removed all the glue with that. So, not too bad. I like ATR.